Hello, this is Pamela. Welcome to my channel. Grab you a cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and enjoy some good old yarny talk. Hello, this is Pamela, and you're on Pamela's Adoring Crochet. I'd like to say good morning. How are you guys doing today? And I'd like to say how much I appreciate you guys, and I love having my crochet chats with you guys. Um, and I just want to say thank you for all the comments, the likes, the shares, and for all the um, things that you are posting in my Facebook group page and all the tags I'm getting off Instagram. I love seeing all the things that you guys are up to. Oh, and then tomorrow's video is Whip Caddy Wednesday. Uh, so if you haven't emailed me or posted in the Facebook group page a photo of your whip cart, that's the three-tier cart, of what all you got going in on in there, please do that today because the video will be tomorrow. And I put my videos out kind of early. Um, whenever I get the pictures of the carts and things tonight on Tuesday nights is whenever I put together that part of the video of all of you guys' carts. So, uh, yeah, try to get those in today if you can. So you can be in tomorrow's videos. Everyone loves seeing what everyone is up to. We love all the beautiful projects that are going on in your carts. So, yeah, do that, guys. <laughs> I appreciate it, guys. Let's go ahead and get started. Um, today, I'm drinking out of my Make Things Happen cup, and it's just good old black coffee today. Mmm, it's always so good in the mornings. <laughs> that first sip of coffee. Mmm, just can't beat that. Um, okay, so today I do have some video clips. Well, first I'd like to say this is one of my ponchos. I wore the uh, turquoise colored one yesterday, and today I'm wearing the wild carnation one. And if any of you guys have this yarn and you would like to um, sell it to me, trade with me, whatever, I need some of this. I need at least one of this. This is Yarn Bee Glowing, and the color is called Coast is Clear. It's this one right here. The poncho that I'm working on for this one, I want to wear this with some jeans. But isn't it pretty? So, now this one I wouldn't be able to wear uh, probably till this fall because it's, you know, unless it's a really chilly morning like today, I mean, it'd be fine. But, you know, acrylics, four weight acrylics, a little bit thicker and warmer. <laughs> And the only reason why I'm able to wear this today is because it is very early and it's in the house. <laughs> but I wouldn't want to wear this out running around shopping and things like that because it's a little warm. And uh, like right now, it feels fabulous. <laughs> yeah, so I just need one more of these. Um, this one will just about do it. But it's just not quite enough. That's why I have to have just one more. So before I get started on the video clip, I just want to remind you guys to go to, I guess it's Rikurumi. R-I-C-O-R-U-M-I. -R they have their, it's a crochet along of Amigurumis. And this is the one they just put out. It's free. I'll leave the link below so you can go check it out if you haven't yet. And uh, this week it's the a lamb. It's called the Beach Party Series. And um, so that's kind of what it looks like. There's instructions. I have not made one of these yet, but that's because I've been um, sidetracked with something else. So, um, but they're free, so don't forget to get them because after a certain date, these patterns aren't free anymore. Week, you want to make sure that you go and you download these to your device, save them, print them, whatever you got to do because then they're going to be a paid pattern. Not that there's anything wrong with that, but, you know, while they're free, why, go, why not go ahead and take advantage of that? So, here is, um, I believe that was week one. Some of you guys have already seen this, but if you haven't, there's week two, there's week three, and and now that's week four. So yeah, so go check those out. Um, like I said, I will leave their link below so that um, you can make these too. And don't forget that today, Crystal from Bag o Day, she puts out her ninth square. Um, if I don't drop these. Mine are a mess right now because I moved them. But here's all my squares. <laughs> and I'm getting ready to, um, I guess we'll be putting these together. So, like I said, this is my favorite. <laughs> oh, my least favorite. 
And it's not the design, it's just the clown look I'm not favored with. And there's that, that's, you know, your traditional. And uh, the block, I've done several blankets in this block square design. This makes a really nice blanket. This is eight squares, so tonight she will put out her ninth square. So I'm looking forward to that. And I don't even know what the colors are going to be. So I'll leave the link below for this one. Um, and like I said, it's never too late to get involved in this. You can do this any time of year. They're her videos, so they're always going to be on her channel. And one more thing. Uh, my crochet hook finally came in. My 2.5. I've been waiting on this for about two weeks. Um, I was giving up on it. Maybe it got lost or something. So let's see what this looks like. It is tiny. But here it is. That's my newest hook. 2.5. Um, I went out of town yesterday. It's not that far. It's only maybe 30, 40 minutes, something like that. Let's go ahead and see this video clip of when I went to Conway, Arkansas and ate and went to Hobby Lobby out there. This is the restaurant. This is called Stobie's. It's in Conway, Arkansas. It's pretty packed inside. Actually, um, I already ate, so I came out here to film it so you can see what it looks like. They have a patio. I'm pretty stuffed. Okay, so now we're headed to the bakery next door, and it says that if you show your receipt, you get a cupcake for a dollar. So, that's what we're going to do. Okay, here it is. It's called Patty Cakes Bakery. So, yeah, looks like. Oops, gotta move out of the way. Anyway, so here it is. They put our cupcakes oh, in. That's good. That's okay. All right, guys. Now we're at Hobby Lobby. Try not to run over somebody. Just got to find a parking spot. Here's the yarn that I ended up buying while I was at Hobby Lobby. And it's called I Love This Cotton. It's my first time to buy this, so I haven't got to work it up and see what it feels like as far as worked up, but um, it sure feels good, though. Um, let's see what it says about it. It says, I love this cotton, super soft, super savings. Okay, it said it's made in Turkey. This is, like I said, from Hobby Lobby. It's called Denim Blue, this color is. It's 153 yards 
100% cotton and it's a medium floor weight. It was $379 and they were 30% off today. Said it uses a 5.5 or what they recommend is a 5.5 millimeter crochet hook and a 5 millimeter knitting needle. Made with US fibers. Anyway, so like I said, it's my first time to buy this. I love this cotton, so I was pretty excited to get this. There were so many selections, I didn't know what to get. But I ended up with this, like I said. And if I really like it, I will buy me some more of this and start making some of my wearables and stuff with this. Um, this one is called Paris in June. It's 153 yards and 100% cotton, so everything else should be the same. So 153 yards in that one. So I got three of the, did it say, did I say Paris in June? Yeah. So I got three of the Paris in June and then two of this denim blue. So that's it. Oh, and I did get some free patterns that I pulled down. Let's see what I got. Amigurumi patterns. I just thought that they were just adorable. I couldn't believe I was seeing Amigurumi patterns. Okay, then I got this scrub up. I thought this would be really cute. And this warm up afghan. So, yeah, those are the three free little patterns that I pulled off of their little pull down thing that they had, little hook. Okay, so I've got them opened up, and here's what they look like on the inside. It's almond coffee, I think is what it is. My husband says just chocolate. These have been sitting in our fridge because I like my cakes and stuff. I really like them cold. Now, some things I like to warm up in the microwave, but uh, not my cakes. I like them when they're a little bit cold being in the fridge. Anyway, so I thought you guys might want to see that after you saw me go to the bakery. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys um wasn't that fun and um i haven't eaten the cupcake yet so um maybe sometime today i'll get around to doing that and um but yeah let's go ahead and read the 365 days of prayer beautiful reflection one thing i ask from the lord this only do i seek that i may dwell in the house of the lord all the days of my life to gaze on the beauty of the Lord and to seek him in his temple. Psalms 27 verse 4. Holy One, you are the one I live for. As I seek after you with all my heart, the desire to know you grows ever stronger. I am so grateful for relationship that I can know you and follow you all the days of my life. Lord, I ask for a fresh revelation of your beauty. I want to see you in a way I've never seen you before. Fill my heart with the knowledge of your goodness. There is nothing that you give out of your generous heart of the love that ends up being meaningless. You are full of so much grace and goodness, I could never take it all. Lord, may my life be a beautiful reflection of your life within mine. Your ways are perfect and you are making me more like you by the day. I am so grateful. Keep it coming until I stand with you in your forever kingdom. And then it says, how is the life of Jesus reflected in your life? That is one of my prayers, is that Jesus is reflected in my life. Okay, guys, I'm so glad you enjoyed that. And um, on my poncho here, I will leave the link to the tutorial to make this beautiful poncho and um, a link to the PDF pattern. And like I said, this is my first time to design a poncho, so I'm very excited. And I love your guys' response. I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you so much for all the positive uh, responses and that I've gotten from that. It just really makes me feel good and it just makes me want to create more. I'm like, man, they really loved it. So um, anyway, I just want to say thank you guys. Like I said earlier, be sure and post your uh, whip caddy photos so that I can include them in tomorrow's video. I look forward to that and so does everyone else. Anyway, guys, uh, just remember to live life, have fun, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.